Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome back to the channel. I just got home from the movie theater, went to see Blue Beetle, took my daughter to go see it. And what did I think? Well, I enjoyed it a lot more than I enjoyed Flash. I'll tell you that much. Um, this was actually a really enjoyable film. Right off the bat, I'm going to give my score. I'm not going to waste any time giving my score. I'm going to give this one an 8 out of 10, just because I think that my daughter really enjoyed it. I really enjoyed it. And I think there was just a lot, it was a lot more, I, you know, I, I didn't go in with high expectations. I had heard, you know, good things so far, you know, with the Rotten Tomato scores for the film and everything. But I didn't really go in with high expectations. The trailer looked interesting. And, you know, some of the jokes landed for me during the trailer. But they landed a little bit more actually seeing the film, you know, in its in, uh, entirety. Really enjoyed this one. I wasn't sure how it was going to work, you know, as far as like George Lopez playing his uncle um, in the film. But you know what? I think most of the jokes, the really good jokes, went the way of George Lopez. I think that would, I think he was cast, cast well in the film. Now, the gentleman playing um, Jaime Reyes did a really good job. I hadn't seen him in anything before, but he did a really solid job, really um, coming through with the emotion with things that happen in the film, I'm not going to spoil anything because, again, this is one that I, box office wise, the numbers came in about like 25 million for the weekend. It deserves a little, a little bit more than that, I think. But the problem is with DC right now, things have just underperformed, especially with a lot of people knowing that, you know, the new regime coming in for DC, just rebooting everything. But it's kind of a shame because I think this one definitely deserves a little bit more love than I think it's probably going to wind up getting at the box office. But like I said, the gentleman playing um, Jaime, he did a really, really solid job. Like I said, with the emotional parts of the film, as well as, you know, when the scarab enters his body and he starts, you know, changing into Blue Beetle. I really enjoyed it. I think his reactions to all that trans you know transformations parts you know parts through the film yeah i enjoyed that a lot i, th I think he really sold it like that it was you know give it more realism to it and you know he delivered some comedic parts as well um not as much as george, george lopez did but i actually I, I enjoyed this one the action was spot on uh the later especially later on in the film i really enjoyed the action with this and I think the CGI worked too with the you know with the whole costume and everything I think it really benefited I, unfortunately I didn't get a chance to see it in IMAX because there are some scenes that I think would have really shined through big time in IMAX but this is one that would definitely I'll be definitely be picking this one up when it comes out on 4k I enjoyed it that much and eight, like I said eight out of ten for this one um but definitely get out there and go see Blue Beetle I think it, it's it's fun for the whole family. I think the whole family can go see this. And I think, you know, it's enjoyable. It's an enjoyable film for the whole family. And it's, it's it, like I said, it's, I believe it's coming in number one at the box office this weekend. But like I said, numbers wise, I just, I was hoping it would be, you know, maybe because, you know, surprise people and kind of wind up getting a little bit, you know, better number wise than what it did. Make it to about 25 million. But we'll, you know, we'll see. We'll see what the future holds. Maybe James Gunn will decide to keep Blue Beetle in his new DC universe. That would be a pretty, uh, pretty cool thing because I think there's definitely a lot of room to grow with this character and with this franchise. I think even if they kept it like an in, its own individual entity, I think it could work. I absolutely think it could work because I, I really. I think, like I said, I think there's a lot there to benefit. You know, from expanding you know, on the Blue Beetle, and man, just go see it, go see it, 8 out of 10, really enjoyed this one, it, it was a pleasant surprise, I enjoyed it a lot more than I thought I would, so, like, subscribe, and comment if you have a chance, and I will catch you in another episode, take care.